Hi Laser Skin friends, Eric here from Laser Skin TV. This is a short video about the new registration features in the Faucine 2023 20, uh, version. I installed it on my computer and I tried it out and I will give you a short feedback in this video. Stay tuned if you like to be informed. I have here installed one of the newest version, the 23.1.0 version on my computer <clears throat> and uh, as you know from my uh, show <clears throat> Frau announced that they do some new features for the registration like uh, bundle adjustment and also uh, connections, a show connection between scans and I use an old project what I can share it's um, one project where I got uh, the for two years or for one and a half year, I got the new premium scanner for testing from Faro, and I uh, done a lot of scans. And I can show you. It's uh, outside the CM city, and there is an old ship, and I do a lot of scans to this time around the ship with color, with no color, and I want to see how good the data sets looks like, and that was my goal, and I was also thinking that maybe I can later connected uh, all scans together to one model and I done this for one and a half year and this was not able to um, collect in all scans together you know I have some scans in a higher position and very low scans below the ship <clears throat> and then of both sides and especially on the other sides if we go in the so the two scan uh, I don't use any target points for this because I don't have so many time and I want more check these and you see that's not the that's me here uh, that's not the best area for cloud to cloud registration because you know it's very far away some points here and this is very similar shape <clears throat> and I, I remember me that in the past where I done it I was not able to fix the whole model together then I start this again and I make some tests I think we can uh, copy this inside how it works I, I can tell you I put all my scans inside uh, then I say do an automatic registration he does an automatic registration and then he tells me uh, I'm sorry I'm not able to um, can fix all your scans and there was like four or five scans was missing and then I switched and used the top view based registration and move these four scans on the right position let this one again and then I had very good results, but only one scan. The scan number 24 was not able here to fit inside, but it looks very good. And then I had the idea maybe there's something wrong with the computer or my workflow process. And then I try again to do it. And this uh, I already done. And then it's already fixed uh, my, my scan together and I get a very good results. Now with my last version, you see I have a green scan manager and I open my scan manager and I go here to the results and um, you see in, in average I have below uh, 2.6 um, millimeters and 70% um, below 4 millimeters. That's pretty good, a pretty good result uh, for this, uh, especially under this condition as I was not able to do it uh, with the previous version or I had spent a lot of time and don't have this time. What I also like to show you is this connection between scans, this new functionality. You see here, that's my scans condition, uh, my scan position and the software shows me where he is connected and give us also like a quality of this connection. You see we have like if we go to this scan, I think this was the scan uh, maybe 20 or something it's, uh, it's this one um, no, 18 to 20 and if I go then 20 to the back connection to 21 you see I have here a green connection and then I have to the next one because he is below uh, it's only a, a yellow connection and then it's also a connection under the ship and I don't know I really have very good connection here and he say okay I have here a, a red connection and there we can go inside and he say that is a very low number of points like the overlap is only 5% and if you go to an, to this connection 
and there we see we have an overlap from 70%. <clears throat> As I think the overlap and um, it's pretty uh, it's better is something what you need. I think some people say you need 40%, I don't know, 60, 70% that works. Like I have this trouble with these uh, points there where it's very low overlap to not connect them. So the new software helps you to improve the results, make results better, get tricky situation fixed, but of course uh, you should have a good overlap between your scans if you like to use these cloud-to-cloud uh, -cloud and top view based registration. But finally I got my model together and I'm pretty happy with this. This is an old ship. Yeah, I think it's a maintenance ship for the for the rivers from the river association. And I'm also super amazing how also the quality of this. This was a beta version scanner. It's uh, from the scanner and then on a little bit upwards here. There is also a small bridge where you have only few points with cloud cloud uh, based registration. But it looks also all fine, no double lines here. Everything that's well, you can also see it here. We have here is a coffee, and here we have the thin structure. And you don't see any double lines here on these uh, frames here in this uh, area. I, I, I'm uh, totally uh, um, surprised with these uh, new uh, functionality and the improvement in the registration. I think it's much better as before, and uh, I think will uh, helps us to work with more. Uh, uh, using this uh, um, solution for tricky projects. Um, we will do another test, a big test, where we combined uh, larger areas with different scanner, maybe with August. This will be our next text, um, test and this will be also announced our results. And if you like to be informed, stay tuned and like everybody, don't like every time, don't forget, uh, subscribe to the channel, leave me a comment, give you a thumbs up. Bye bye, Eric.